Our Lord Jesus Christ himself was a guest at a wedding in Cana of Galilee. Scriptures teach us that the marriage is a gift from God in creation. And a means of his grace, a holy mystery in which man and woman become one flesh. It is God's purpose that as husband and wife give themselves to each other in love, throughout their lives they should be united in that love and Christ and show Christ as united with his church. Marriage is also given that husband and wife may comfort and help each other, living faithfully together in need and in plenty, in sorrow and in joy. It's given that with delight and tenderness that they may know each other in love and true joy of their bodily union, may have children, be blessed in caring for them, and bring them up in accordance with God's will to the praise and the glory of our master Jesus. In marriage, husband and wife belong to one another. They begin a new life in community. Marriage is a way of life that all of us should honor and must not be undertaken carelessly, lightly, or selfishly, but reverently, responsibly, and after serious thought. This is a way of life that honors God, that you, Joshua, and you, Julie, are going to begin. I know you said you were always longing to be heard. So now I'm right here, hanging on to every single word. All that I am, all that I am, I give to you. I give to you. And all that I have, and all that I have, I share with you. I share with you. I honor you. All that I am, I give to you. And all that I have, I share with you. Oh. 